Hey everyone, this is Pargo Suthar and today we will discuss other types of graphs that is Eulerian graph and Hamiltonian graph. So in this uh, session we will discuss what is an Eulerian path, what is an Eulerian circuit, what is a Hamiltonian graph and what is a Hamiltonian circuit. Okay, so first let us discuss what is an Eulerian path. So uh, a path is known as Eulerian path if every edge of the graph appears exactly once in the path. Fine. Now let us discuss what is a circuit. We know that what is a circuit. So the circuit which contains every edge of the graph exactly once. So that means in a circuit the edge has to be uh, appear only once. Fine. Each and every edge uh, must appear exactly once. So uh, it's called an Eulerian circuit. Now what is an Eulerian graph? So a graph which has an Eulerian circuit is known as an Eulerian graph. Fine. So let us discuss examples. So uh, this is the example, fine. Now uh, this uh, graph has an Eulerian, uh, it is an Eulerian graph as this G contains an Eulerian circuit. So what is that circuit? So let us start from this A, E, B, E2, C, E3, D and E4 and again A. So you can see that uh, we have covered all these uh, edges exactly once, fine. So it is an Eulerian circuit. Now let us discuss another example. So just consider this graph, fine. So this G contains an Eulerian path, but not Eulerian circuit. Why? This uh, G contains Eulerian path, but not Eulerian circuit. So what is that Eulerian path? Just start from this middle uh, vertex, okay. So uh, E, E7, then B, even A, E6, F, E5, E4, D, E3, C, E2, and B, fine. So we have covered all the uh, edges but we cannot cover all the uh, edges plus it can cannot be a circuit okay so it is an Eulerian path but not an Eulerian circuit so let us discuss some of the important theorems so the first theorem now an undirected graph that means directionless uh, possesses an Eulerian path if and only if it is connected and has uh, either zero or two vertices of odd degree okay let us discuss second theorem an undirected graph possesses an Eulerian circuit. In previous it was for Eulerian path. Now this one is for Eulerian circuit. If, if and only if it is connected and its vertices are all of even degree. Okay, so for Eulerian path, it has to be connected and it has either zero or two vertices of odd degree. And for Eulerian circuit, it should be connected first and then its all vertices uh, are of even degree. Okay, now let us discuss example. So the question is, which of the following graphs possesses Euler's path or Euler's circuit? So just consider this graph and the second graph. Now see, uh, the first one contains uh, what? A path or a circuit. Now you can see that uh, in graph one. Now what is the degree of each and every vertex? So here you can see that the degree of this first vertex that is two. Here you can see that the degree uh, is four. Here also you can see that the degree is four. Here the degree is 2. So that means uh, we can see that this each vertex it is of even degree. So hence it is uh, an Eulerian circuit. Okay. Now in second example you can see that this graph 2 the second graph that is connected and it has exactly two vertices of odd degree and which are they this this the first one and this the last one. Okay. They have the degree uh, uh, 1 fine. So they are two vertices of odd degree. So what we can say that it has an Euler's path but not a circuit. Fine. Now let us discuss what is a Hamiltonian path. So a path in a connected graph G, it is a Hamiltonian path if it contains every vertex of G exactly once. In Eulerian path, uh, there was uh, for every edge. So now here in Hamiltonian path, it is for every vertex. Fine. Now let us discuss what is a Hamiltonian circuit. So a path in a connected graph G, it is a Hamiltonian circuit if it, can, uh, if it contains every vertex of G exactly once except the first and the last vertex. Why? Because it is a circuit. Fine. So let us discuss example. So just consider this is a good example. So a game invented by Sir William Hamilton in 1859 uses a regular solid dodecahedron whose 20 vertices are labeled with the names of famous cities. Okay. And the player is challenged to travel uh, the, the problem name is around the world 
so the player is challenged to travel around the world by finding a closed circuit along the edges which passes through each vertex that means each and every cities exactly once so this is the regular dodecahedron solid dodecahedron so here we have total 20 vertices that means 20 cities now a traveler must be able to uh, travel all the cities exactly once and come back to the first city fine so what will be the uh, eulerian uh, so what will be the hamiltonian circuit just think about it it is very tricky so one such hamiltonian circuit i will uh, give you the answer and that is this just see consider start from this 2 so just start from 2 then go to 3 then 10 then 11 then 12 then come back uh, okay fine then 4 then go to 5 then 1 then 6 then 7 then 17 then 16 then 15 uh, then 14 then 13 then 20 then 19 then 18 uh, then 9 then 2 then 9 and 8 and 2 and 2 okay so this is one such Hamiltonian circuit so it, uh, there can be a different circuit fine so this is a good example now let us discuss another example now you must have uh, come across or you must have seen this type of figure in your schools that draw such graph without shifting a pen so, so that is uh, what does that mean so that means uh, we need to cover all the uh, edges okay so it is an Eulerian circuit so is it, uh, is it uh, an Eulerian circuit so that means we need to cover all the edges so uh, you can see that this uh, see how many uh, the degree of each vertex is what so you can see that this degree of each vertex is 5 that is an odd number but we know the theorem that uh, in Eulerian circuit uh, each and every vertex has to be of even number so but here we have odd so that means we cannot draw this type of graph without shifting a pen okay so that is not an Eulerian circuit thank you